hi everyone ramesh here back again with another video in this video we are going to learn how to create a immutable array list hash set hash map with lots of coding examples all right so in case of array list before java 9 we were using collections.unmodifiable list to make our list as a immutable and java 9 provides a list.op method to make our list as a immutable all right so we are going to see both the ways with a coding example so similarly has set so before java 9 we were using collections dot unmodifiable set method to make a has set as a immutable and java 9 provides set dot op method to make a you know has set as a immutable so we'll see both the ways with the coding examples a bit later similarly has map so we can use collections dot unmodifiable map method to make a hash map as a immutable but java 9 again provides map dot op entries method to make a hash map as a immutable all right so let's go ahead and let us see how to make our list has set and hash map uh, immutable with a lots of coding examples let me switch to the eclipse ide let me create examples to demonstrate uh, how to make our list has set and hash map immutable with a lots of coding examples let's get started all right for that i am going to create a class here and I'm going to name it as immutable list example. All right, and here I'm going to create a main method. Okay, so we'll see how to create a immutable list before Java 9, and then we also see how to create a immutable list using Java 9 factory methods. All right. So here I'm going to create a list, list of fruits, and now we're going to see how to make this array list as a immutable. Okay, so before I just write the comment here before Java 9, we're supposed to use collections dot unmodifiable list all right here we go so before java 9 we were supposed to use collections dot unmodifiable list method to make a list or a list as a immutable list okay and as we know that once we create a immutable list we cannot add or remove the elements from it all right for example if you try to add uh, you know element to the list here it will throw unsupport unsupported operation exceptions for example here i am going to just add one more fruit and what i will do is i will just print this fruits to the console and i'm going to run the program so look at here it will use uh, unsupported operation exception because we have once we create a immutable list we cannot add or remove the elements all right so this is how we create a immutable list before java 9 and in java 9 we can uh, you know the new factory methods are introduced so we can use our new factory methods and we can create a immutable list so how to do that so let me show you how to do that so let me let me comment this code okay and here i'm going to create a list list of string and here i will create a again fruits and list interface has op method so look at here op method is overloaded here so there are a lot of overloaded op methods and you can use appropriate method here so let's create uh, elements like banana, apple, mango, and orange. All right. Now this is the immutable list. All right. So look at here the description of op method here. So this method returns an immutable list containing four elements because op element op method you know there are a lot of already op methods so we can use appropriate method here we are using four argument we are using method which has a four arguments all right 
so op method returns the immutable list so if you try to add uh, or if you try to modify this list then this will throw the exception for example so i have added a strawberry uh, you know proof to the proof list here and i'm going to just print to the console here and i will just run the program so look at here it will throw the exception unsupported operation exception because it is a immutable list we cannot add a uh, element to it okay so this is how we create a immutable list using java 9 and before java 9 that is using collections dot unmodifiable list okay now let us see how to create a immutable set using java 9 factory methods so just let me create a class and here i'm going to call it as immutable set example okay and let's create a main method and here what we do is we are going to create a set set of set up roots okay and here this is the set set of roots now what we'll do we'll see how to create a immutable set before java 9 all right so before java 9 so before java 9 we're supposed to use collections dot unmodifiable set and here we pass the set here okay and if you try to add any elements to immutable set then this will you know gives you or unsupported operation exception for example let me run this program and let me show you so look at here it throws unsupported exception unsupported operation exception because it is a immutable set we cannot add uh, again elements to the immutable set okay so let me show you how to create a immutable set using java 9 factory methods so here i will create a list of string and i am going to just comment out this code here and this is roots again and here i'm going to use set op so look at here again there are a lot of overloaded op methods so you can use appropriate method based on the elements so here i'm using four argument op, op method i'm going to pass a banana and here orange and mango okay so this is the immutable set yeah so if you try to modify this set then this will use you unsupported operation exception okay so let me show you show you that so let's run this program and here is the output so look at here it, it throws uh, you know unsupported operation exception because we are uh, we are trying to add here new element to the immutable set so this is how we create a immutable set using java 9 factory method all right so you i i hope you understood how to create a immutable list and immutable set now let us see how to create a immutable hash map so for that i'm going to create again a class and i'm going to call it as immutable hash map all right and let's create a main method let's create a map map string string and here i will just call again proofs let's use a hash map okay now let's add a few entries to the map here use put method and here i'm going to add one and value as banana okay and again i will add fruits 
dot put and let's add a key as two and value as mango and let's add one more entry fruits dot put and here let's add a key as three and value as apple all right and so let us see before java 9 how how we were you know uh, supposed to create immutable hash map so we use a collections utility class it provides a un, uh, unmodifiable map here and here we need to pass a fruits okay fruits is a map and and here we print to the console so let's go ahead and let's run this program and here is the output so look at here one banana two mango three apple so if you try to add any new entry to this immutable hash map then this will throw us unsupported operation exception like immutable list and immutable set so here i will just try to add some entry here and we will see how it throws the exception so look at here it throws unsupported operation exception so we cannot add a entry to the immutable hash map all right so this is how we create a immutable hash map before java 9 so let us see how to create a you know a immutable hash map using java 9 with factory methods okay so here what i will do is i will just create a map with key as a string and value as string and i will call it as a map and here i will use map dot so entry so look at here entries op entries so op entries is the method okay similarly let's create a few more entries let me quickly copy this This is two and this is three and two is mango three is apple and this is how we create a you know immutable hash map now let's print this map to the console pretty simple right now let's go ahead and let's run the program So look at the output here okay one banana two mango and three as apple so this is how we create a immutable hash map in you know uh, in java 9 using factory methods and also before java 9 how we create a immutable hash map using collections dot unmodifiable map all right so i hope you understood how to create a immutable list immutable set and immutable hash map using java 9 factory methods all right so if you found this video tutorial useful then consider subscribing so that whenever i will publish new videos you will get notified thanks for watching i will see you in the next video